So it's Dr Ben Spencer. Thank you, Madam Deputy Speaker. The introduction of a 14-day quarantine is a very blunt tool, with many downsides and consequences, and it effectively grounds the aviation industry. Would my right honourable friend agree with me that rather than using this blunt tool, we should move as quickly as possible to a precise and targeted approach based on science and international safety standards that will protect passengers, the public, but also staff working in the airlines, the airports and on public transport, and in doing so enable our planes to fly again, saving livelihoods and businesses while keeping the public safe? Well, my honourable friend makes very, very important points, and actually, I would like to pay tribute to the aviation sector and the industry. They are dynamic, they are innovative, and when we look at the work that they have done over decades when it comes to keeping the public safe, when it comes to aviation travel, they have been world leading. That is exactly what we want to do in terms of the work that we undertake with them. Of course, this is an international crisis. No one person, no one organisation has a bespoke way of working throughout this crisis for the aviation sector. My final point, Madam Deputy Speaker, on this, um, my final point on this is, of course, planes are still flying and goods are coming into the United Kingdom. I've made the point about exports goods. This is still very important for the aviation sector, for the freight sector in particular. And, of course, that's very important to the um, health of our economy, but also the way in which we can continue to innovate. Thank you. Christine Jardine. 